So the abuse of the river had been stopped thanks to the hard work of the canal group. But how do you clean up a river that's been abused for just about 200 years? Well, that's where ZAP comes in. ZAP. Where in the world do they come up with the term ZAP? <laughs> I, have, I have no idea. I think it was just a ZAP uh, meaning to get rid of, rid of uh, all the trash and debris that was here. Not many people knew really uh, what ZAP meant. And, and then it came to be known that it meant to step everything away, take, take everything out. And I, I regret this to this day. Uh, uh, one of the, uh, one of the uh, newsroom people, one of the reporters, came up to me and sat down. And he says, Late, he says, I got an idea. He says, I think you ought to name this project that you're doing, this river cleanup along the Blackstone, Zap. He says it's, it's quick and easy, and it, it, it means to completely obliterate whatever is there. And I forget his name and I would like to give him credit for the fact that he was the one that came in and suggested that we use the word, uh, the name Zap for it because I think it had something to do with the popularity of it. <laughs>